in these uncertain times, I want to give you a promise from God. In Genesis 28 verse 15, when Jacob was going through his uncertain times, God spoke to him and said, I am with you. I will protect you everywhere you go. I will bring you back to this land. I will not leave you until I have done everything that I have promised. Three things I want to speak on. I am with you. I will protect you everywhere you go. And I will not leave you until I have done everything I have promised. Isn't that an amazing promise? I believe the same word God wants to speak over you, that he will do everything that he has promised. Until he does it, he will not leave you. He says, I will be with you. I will be with you. I want to encourage you today, no matter what you are facing, God says he is for you, not against you. God says he counts you precious. God says that you are you are his prized possession. God says that you are his very own. He says you are his child. He loves you with an everlasting love. I want you to keep your eyes fixed on God and rest in the promise that God has made. You know, scripture has so many promises and the beauty for you and me who are connected in Jesus is that every promise that God speaks is a yes and an amen. Every time you read the word for your circumstance and situation, that word becomes a rema word that speaks over your life. That's the promise of God. And one thing I want to say, God says he will do it. He said it, he will do it. All you need to do is rest in the finished work of God. That's his promise for you. What he says in Genesis 28, I am with you, I will protect you, and I will not leave you till I do what I have promised you. Hold on to this promise. I'm sure in these difficult times, as you hold on to God and his word, you will see God fulfill everything that he has spoken over you. God bless you.